Oh, that's a better. I thought I was pulling it over a branch because it was like thump, 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 thump. On the drop, it just felt right. Oh. In 3D, folks. Oh, I saw that. Yeah, I did see that thump. Better fish? That's about three. Fatty too. Nice job. I just like to see it hit the ground and I see the line just spitting off. Yeah. Fun fish. Or under a rock that we can't see in the shade. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Wow. I have no idea. It was a bass. That hole? It launched itself out of the water. There goes my creature bait. That, it's gone. Creature bait's gone. Yeah. Oh. oh. There it was. See, it's, it's, too, it's, it's instant. Instant. It's instant, oh. I tell you. This feels like a better fish, maybe. It's totally instant, I tell you. Flipping it. Bare. Not all the biggest fish in the world, but I, they're fun. Well, it's funny, I pulled the stick out of it. Oh. Oh. Right off here. <laughs> What's that? No, oh. Again, they're not that big, but it's nice that these things are all you can jigs. It's so much fun. Double digits, here we come. Aren't we having so much fun? Oh. At Augusta, Cinderella story. Are you going to let her use an eye? You're a trip. Ooh, that was a good one. That was right where you wanted it. Cutters. Get him? Yeah. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Get him all the way back what? Yeah. All the way in. Yeah, exactly. Well, 
and that really is a fish. It didn't move on stuff that way. No? I didn't see it. Nice one. You got the two biggest ones of the day, that's for sure. Oh yeah. Yeah. Another one. Two for two. Huh? Two for two. Fish there? Nope. Right there? Yep. What, you saw him move? No, I think there was a fish there. God told me. <laughs> Is that on camera? What's that? Is that on camera? Yeah. Please tell me it's on camera. Yeah, oh yeah. That's a Larry. God told me. Brad is one of the prophets. Yeah. Matthew, Mark, Luke, and Brad. <laughs> Need help. Mm. <laughs> right there? Yeah. I haven't gotten it yet. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you feel like a nut, sometimes you feel like a screw. Here we go. Huh? Yeah. Ah! Right in my finger. Yeah, and went into my finger. That it did. Go barbless hooks. Note to everybody else. So uh, today's uh, beer tasting on the flow tube is going to be the Outdoor Escape from Pizza Port. Never had this one. So it's an IPA, I love IPAs. This one's 7.2% and a uh, little bit fruity, a little bit more piney. More West Coast style, bitter, full bodied, good body, excellent West Coast IPA style taste. Mm. 
Gotta love them hops. So far, Brad has 28. 28? 28. 28 bass. I got 18. He's crushing me, so don't call it a comeback. I've been here for years. We're at Lake Barrett. It's been a great day. Mild temperatures. A little bit of wind. They said 20 knot winds and not even close to 20 knot winds. Here we are. Let's catch some fish. Here's been where I increased my lead. Basically flipping jigs all day. Brad had a spinnerbait bite in the morning. See what we can do here. Still waiting for the big fish for the day. Brad got a couple that were like three pounds. That's about it, man. That's, the That's about the biggest. I've had two about that size. That's it. Everything else has been like a pound and a half cookie cutter pound and a halfers but all biting the jig no they hadn't did not I, we got one worm bite first thing in the day and uh that's about it but see, see what we can do as the uh afternoon rolls on it's about 2 30. yeah we worked this shoreline earlier a lot of fun a lot of, uh, a lot of bites. And then the bite kind of ducked. They hit the water and they just run with it for two seconds. Exactly. I was fishing a, a watermelon uh, quarter ounce jig <laughs> with a uh, baby brush hog watermelon trailer. But the jig, uh, the, the um, hook on the jig was a light wire jig, light wire hook, and it kept bending. So, still using a quarter ounce jig, nice and light. And a big, now I'm using a big beaver trailer. Brad, you want to see what I'm using? Here comes mine. I'll yeah. see what I'm using. Exactly. <laughs> it really hasn't seemed to matter what color we throw. Just more getting it right in front of them. Brad had a spinnerbait bite earlier, and that's uh, took the lead early with that, and I've never been able to catch up. But I think last time we were out here, it was just the opposite, right? Oh, there we go. Oh, God bless it. What the hell, Chris? What the hell? It's going to drive me to drink. Let me make sure I still have a hook on this. I've gotten like I, I've hooked like four fish out here. Yeah. There is a hook on here. I promise. No barb. Barbless, artificial lures only. Kidding me. So 
Let's see if I can officially get a number 19. Ooh, what a color of that thing. Thank you. Yeah. I'll Ooh. take that. He tried to give me a Mercy number 19, not a chance. <laughs> oh, very light colored vest. Yeah, color, that's color that's 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 yeah. That's the fifth hit. Right off, right off this uh, little ledge or whatever. I mean, you can see. Too, wasn't it? What's that? It was deeper too. It's only 15 feet right here. Oh, so you, but you weren't getting it up there. You're getting it coming down the ledge. That time, yeah. The other ones I got right up on there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that, Brad. <laughs> That's my biggest fish ever. Here. Here. That and is, look at oh that. Oh my god. Out. That's there's no this. barb. Holy crap. Oh. Oh. So we're talking like 25 inches. Brad, you want to do the uh oh. you got any ideas? What are you thinking? Um, uh, I think over eight. Yeah. Is it gonna hold? <laughs> no. Oh my god. There you go. You should have it now. There it is, folks. Nine point. About nine point one. <laughs> oh, get... That's awesome. That's what we came here for, folks. <laughs> I'm gonna get some pictures. I'm gonna keep in the water for a minute. You get a camera out for me. Hold on. That's a monster right there, folks. So it's going between like 9, 9.2. That is a freaking awesome fish. Yeah, we're good. Oh, there we go. Nice. Woohoo! <laughs> Enjoy the adrenaline boost. Oh bills. my goodness gracious. Oh, and... Ladies and gentlemen, that is why we fish. Holy crap and old. Oh, <laughs> oh yes! <laughs> Great job, man. Glad we got a new scale. but it's a 20. <laughs> Is that right below you pretty much? Yeah. Fish? It's just a runner. <laughs> oh. oh! Nice fish. You know what? I changed to the uh, black and blue beaver. Immediate difference. A huge. Well, I've just gotten like five bites and two fish in like just a couple of minutes. 
and that's normally my go-to, but I was just trying to do something different today. And goes to show. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Change to the black and blue. I don't know why I was being so stubborn. God. You're not getting no shallow either. No, I'm not getting no shallow. Going down the edge. I'm, I'm going the pulling it down that, or across that, uh, that rock slope. So I'm towing Brad in the float tube. Right. Well, we finally right. put the new battery on at 520 this afternoon. So it's our third battery for the day, but towing two of us basically all the way around Barrett all day. And uh, currently 1.88 miles per hour. What speed? Like 55%. Oh yeah, it's rubbing fun. Oh yeah. What a beautiful day. I'd like to get a couple more, but I'm not gonna be greedy. Enjoyed having the day I did. It's time to go home. I'm tired. I had a great time. Brad caught his biggest non-spawn fish ever. 9.1 pound bass on a black and blue jig. Beautiful. What a great day. Lake Barrett's always fun. It's the black and blue tour. Black and blue jigs with black and blue beavers is what produced the best today. Up against the shore, off the rock piles, all those things. Totally worth doing again. Enjoy when you come out here.